So right now we have to sometimes how many we have to lock your lay. So with the same motion from the right to left, you bring your raffia over, and then these two you be well continue to hold the lay. But now we use your middle finger here, and then you catch your finger with the raffia, and you bring the raffia back up, and now that forms a loop here. And that loop, the raffia, when you bring it back up, will enter it, enter the loop. Because, okay? And then, again, from the bottom, your hand is moving from the bottom, you pull that raffia through the loop, and that will kind of make a, a musubu, a musubu, a lock for yeah. your lei. Okay, like that. All right, so this is how it you can how it works with flowers. You have your you put like some fern. You're holding the fern and the back of your lay. If this part is too long, you can break it off and put it right back into the lay like that. With the carnation here, I really like to catch this part of the carnation, the green part of the carnation. You can use your finger to open up the flower like this. Okay, so then when you come over, you put your finger right onto the raffia again. You can, at this point, you can let go of the raffia, and then from the bottom, you complete wrapping the lay, and you put your, this finger holds the back of the, the lay, like the raffia. So it looks like this. Okay, this is the back. I'm holding the wrapping raffia with this finger and this is the front okay so then again you again this this raff is this fern is a little large so you have to break it down I put it in I peel off the bottom and then I keep putting a little bit I keep um, making it smaller and smaller at the whole time holding holding the center so, and then again, wrap the raffia. Oh, this time, let's try to lock the lay. So from right to left, raffia motte. Middle finger, you're gonna use your middle finger. Wrap that raffia around that middle finger. Back around the top. You stick the raffia into the hoop loop here. And then from the bottom, you pull the raffia back to your start position like that. And then you have to be careful because so the, the, you don't, when you finish knotting that, so you don't catch the ferns and the flowers like that. See, and that's it. And at this point, when you lock your lay, you can have two hands and you can prepare more flowers. Or if your raffia is short, for example, if you're, Wrap, wrapping raffia short, make sure you lock your lay first, grab another raffia, and then you can make a little musubu here, a, a knot here. And that's it.